Merry Christmas, guys. Thanks for joining me for another video. Tactical Black Guy here, also known as Preston. I appreciate you guys joining me for another video. Today, we're going to take a look at the Bigfoot Leather Gun Belt. Now, I've been testing and evaluating this belt for the last week, and let me tell you guys, this is an awesome belt. Out of the 25 or so gun belts I have, this one goes in my top three belts. If you want to find out more information about Bigfoot Gun Belts, you can just hit their website up, BigfootGunBelts.com. On the website, you're going to find out what the gun belts are made of. You're going to find out sizing information, pricing information. It's really a high-quality website and gives you um, all the information you'll need to make an informed decision. But if you're in the market for a gun belt, I highly recommend you take a look at this one. The price on this, I believe it's around between $50 and $60 and it's well worth it. So when you first get the belt um, inside the box it's shipped in, you're going to have this plastic bag. Inside this plastic bag, you're going to have your belt um, along with um, the sticker I just showed you. Um, a little card with some information on what the belt's made of. And then, of course, the belt itself. Now, something to note. On the bag, right here in the corner, it has this. American made. That is super important to me. All my tactical type uh, products, probably 90% of them are American made. I make sure of that because I want to support American businesses. So, here it is, guys. The star of the show. This is the Bigfoot Leather Gun Belt. Now, when I talk about specs, I may not be exact when it comes to the specs. So, down below um, in the description, I'm going to include all the specs as well as the website. So, you can go and, and read about um, what the belt is, is made of. Guys, um, as I said, this belt is really a high quality uh, belt. Let's start with the type of leather that it's made out of. This is English bridal leather. That is the top of the line when it comes to um, leather. Okay, so what that means is it's very strong, it's very durable. It's not going to fall apart on you after a, a couple of months of wear. It's going to last a long time. Now, in between those two pieces of English bridal leather, you have a steel core. Now, that steel core is very sturdy, but it also allows the belt um, to flex and move like so but it doesn't allow the belt to crush so it's very sturdy in terms of where my hands are but you can still flex it quite easily you've got a steel core you've got the English bridal um, leather you also have really high quality military grade stitching so if you look really close just pay attention to that attention to detail. Now this stitching, I think it's called Tex 270 or Tech 270. Um, it's typically used in industrial applications. So as you can see, the stitching is really um, high quality. The belt is not going to come apart after uh, a long period of, of wear and tear. It's going to hold up. These do come in several different colors, the black, and I think they do have a brown color. Let's move down here to the hardware. So the hardware is corrosive resistant. So if this gets a little bit wet or um, after months of wear, it's not going to turn colors on you. It's not going to um, uh, show as much. Alright guys, so all in all, you have an amazing belt here. You have the high quality stitching. You have the two pieces of English bridal leather along with the flexible steel core as well as the corrosive resistant hardware. So this right here is one of those products that I highly recommend. Um, the price is right. The materials are of high quality. So I certainly would recommend you go out and pick up one of these belts. Guys, if you got any questions, please leave, leave them down below in the comment section. What I'll do is I'll um, provide the link to Bigfoot gun belts down in the description of this video. 
as well as the specs, just in case I forgot something or I didn't mention something so you guys would know. I'm Tackle Black Guy, and I'm out. Peace.